Hi y'all, back again. Um, so here's a thought process that I have going on about the raw food diet and <clears throat> which um, is making me um, question its sustainability uh, as far as um, where food comes from, um, the amount of foods that we consume and where they're shipped from. And yes, we should all be eating from farmer's markets, for sure, totally. But not everybody's farmer's market is as good as California, for example, where you have, like, the bread basket, right? So, what do you do, say, when you live in, I don't know, Washington, right? Or, you know, so, or Texas in the summertime, and everything is burnt up and fried, and, you know, there's no food to eat. So then you, then you are relying on the, uh, you, you're relying on the gas system. You're relying on food being shipped in big containers. You're relying on food that's not picked fresh, right? So, so yes, yes, you are putting good things into your body, but then the overall political spectrum is a really a good thing. Would a diet with a little bit of meat um, and, you know, eggs, something that you've raised, you've raised your own chickens, you've raised your own goats, or a cow, for that matter, a pig, what have you, and, um, you eat it in small amounts. <coughs> so, for the seasons, I mean, this is, this is something that's, um, you know, the pastoral life is done all around the world. Um, and there's, there's, you know, as far as like going back to a hunter-gatherer situation, we obviously can't do that. There's just not enough arable land. There's not enough, there's just not enough calories out there to sustain us. So the raw food diet, here's the thing that I'm struggling with right now. Is it, is it, is it really a sustainable diet? Um, is it elitist? Um, you know, um, buying all the fancy um, superfoods, whatnot. I mean, granted, you can make a lot of the superfoods. You know, spirulina. I don't. I personally don't know how to make it. Um, maybe somebody else can enlighten me on that one. Um. I'd love to hear people's comments as far as the raw diet and the sustainability um, of the diet. Not your sustainability with the diet, but the sustainability in the larger picture of where food comes from, how it arrives, and um, you know, the people that grow it, are they getting paid a fair wage, etc., etc. That's all for today. Those are my thoughts. Still going strong, but those are my thoughts.